Hey guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. Today we're going to look at how to produce Cobb by a kill. It's a beautiful Punjabi song, and it has more than 276 million views on YouTube alone. Before we begin I'd like to clear that the purpose of this tutorial is not to recreate or copy the track exactly as is. Instead, we are deconstructing this track to better understand the things that go into production of popular tracks and hopefully learn a few tricks along the way. With that said, let's begin creating our track. The song is in the key of A minor and it uses these four chords throughout. The chords are A minor, F major, C major, and G major. I've already divided the song into sections using the arranged track in Studio One, and what I'm going to do is record a part and then copy it to all the sections wherever required. Let's start with the intro section. The intro and the whole song actually has this piano arpeggio. Now I'm not a very good piano player so what I'll do is slow down the tempo and play my part and then bring the tempo up again. There's no shame in doing that. Almost all producers do it at some point. The piano sounds like this. Let's record that. Let's turn the tempo up and listen to our piano. Sounds good, so I'll copy this clip to all the sections. Now, this track uses wind chimes to transition to the next section. So I'll record that. Let's add some bass. Now, this song uses flute a lot. So I'll record only the unique parts and copy paste them wherever they are repeated. Now let's double the flute using a higher octave. Next there is a gated drone sound that I can hear, so I'll add that as well. Now I'll record drums and copy them as well.
Next the track uses acoustic guitars for rhythm and classical or nylon guitar for the lead riffs. We'll record them both. Next we move on to strings which can be heard during the chorus. Now the only part left is the solo which is played using both a melodica and the classical guitar. I'll record the part using an accordion and then copy the MIDI notes to the guitar track. Now let's just copy the notes and listen to our solo. And with this, we are done with our track. Let me know in the comments about what you think about this video. Please remember to like subscribe and share this video. Also, this track is available for free download. Check the link in the description. Now let's listen to the whole track.